probably put my wallet a bit better. Let's try the, the fresh anchovies. I feel like I'm in two ways. We're absolutely in way everywhere. No, I don't like starting in the middle of a story like this, so let's back up a bit. Me and my girlfriend Denise were interrailing through Europe and had now ended up in Spain. We'd explored Zaragoza for a few days and now we had arrived in the Spanish capital, Madrid. Howdy everybody, welcome to Madrid Sea Martin Station. We're in Spain. Now we're gonna have some traditional Spanish Burger King. Yeehaw, Parker! I mean, I did promise you a culinary tour. We're just normal people after all, but don't worry, we'll eat more interesting stuff later. How are they compared to the Italian ones? They're better. <laughs> Definitely better. Better, yeah. But still not... I don't get the hype around them. They're not that good. I've had better. Yeah, definitely better vegan nuggets. Sorry, Burger King. Good effort. Good effort. We tried again. Or without barbecue sauce. With the barbecue sauce, the up with ketchup or mayo turns tasty. Am I close to the camera? Is it too close? Want to try with ketchup as well? Yes. Much better than the barbecue sauce. Yum. It just doesn't work with the barbecue sauce. Interesting. I take it back. The mean words I said before. Very good. Good job. Anyway, after that tasty meal, we headed to our hostel and dropped off our stuff. Welcome to our room. Here we got our own private little balcony. It's leaning. I'm not gonna step on it. She's crazy. I'm so brave. She is crazy. Absolutely not allowed. Do you need some floor? Oh, perfect. We done. Okay. Cool. Oh. Yeah, we got this room for ourselves here. It's it's nice. Always like to have, you know, private room. Look at look at this. Look at this. Just making me angry. Look at this security method. Good luck there. Luck. It's all the illusion. And with our stuff not locked away safely, it was finally time to head out and explore this massive city. We have time. We did it. All good. Cool, let's just keep walking here then. Almost got run over by a skateboard. Dangerous city. Dangerous city. Is this the famous square? <laughs> I think so, yeah. Looks better in the pictures on my phone. Yeah. More square in there, and now it looks. <laughs> so, yeah, if this is the most famous square in Madrid, I don't know if I want to visit the other ones. Turns out that the square behind us was not the famous square. And he didn't correct me. I only yeah. told you I've been there. Yeah. Say it was the most famous one. No. Okay. We're approaching the actual square now. Unless Google Maps also gives me false hopes. Looks like someone else here. Is this the square? Shit. This is not a big square. I thought it was bigger. In the house. Okay. Here we are. Here we are. Look at it. Yeah, it's uh, definitely a square. What do you say about this square? It's squarey. Pretty cool square. I would think. Better than the yeah, the block. Yeah, a lot better. This this is more squarey. Someone has the hammock. Oh, nice! Nice place to chill out up there. We were actually quite surprised by how cozy Madrid was. Like, it's a big city, and I rarely describe big cities as cozy, but it had cobblestone streets, fountains, and it was green everywhere. But at the same time, it had the impressiveness of a European capital city. That's a big cathedral. Here we have the royal palace, and here we have the royal church. Well, I don't know if the church is royal, but... That would be weird. Church. I mean, Can churches be royal? I don't think so. Well, it's, you know, perfectly located in front of the royal palace, which, by the way, looks super cool. It does! 
Let's go and have a look inside. Okay. Uh, can we find the... No, I mean through the fence. Oh. Hmm, that's a lot of ground. The hula gas is impressive. Impressive in real life, I would say. What do you say? I think it looks really cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. There he has to take a picture, of course. Of course. Instagram. Mm -hmm. Everything for Instagram. Yeah. Follow me at Real Voluntary Exile. Follow me at Instagram. Yeah, you'll, you'll find me. Just Google weird guy. We enjoy this little square with the impressive buildings around it. And just under it, there's a park that looks like a small forest. Madrid is so underrated. Crazy. I must agree. From our three hours here, four hours yeah. here. They have so cool churches. Yeah, they really do. We should learn something from that, Italy. Please stop taking money for your cool churches. <laughs> oh well, after a long day of exploring this pretty city, we were hungry. So we headed to Mercado de San Miguel, a quite famous food market, to have some tapas. I could go for some anchovies with pepper. Oh, they have a lot of things here. I can go for some fresh anchovies. I'm gonna do that. And so we're back where we started. Probably put my wallet a bit better. Let's try it, the, the fresh anchovies. I feel like I'm in two ways. We're absolutely Did it taste like cheese? Look, all of really tasty. And I'm gonna taste this one with anchovies. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> oh, I love seafood too, it's so funny. I'm a touch boy for me. It looks really funny. That was really tasty though. Yeah? Yeah. Was it worth 150? Wow. Kinda. It's really tasty. Oh, uh, overbright, but it tastes really tasty. Where's that? Is that fish? Cheese. <laughs> How is it? That one is really good. That was a really good one. Oh, so I see. Maria Power. Let's go. You want to have one? Oh, maybe. Like we're going crazy today. True. It doesn't matter, huh? We're throwing away all our money. Mm -hmm. Oh no, you're already starving. I'm not gonna let you eat. I'm gonna feed. Hey. Oh, okay. Living in the high life. No, she's killing all the food. I can't let you eat your repository. Yes, sir. It's tasty. My mind is better. Yeah, I'm a professional player. This one tastes stolen. Yeah, it really doesn't. It's so great. Does this player always taste like that? No. Is it because of 
this. It's a special. You know, I've had that beer a lot of times. Oh wow. I'm thirsty. Me too. <laughs> Wanna go find you some croquettes? Yeah. So the codfish? Catfish? Yeah, maybe not. Maybe it's mushroom. I would say that's some type of fish. No? Maybe or mushroom. Oh, that's mushroom. That's mushroom. No, it wouldn't make sense if it was the coffee. That's mushroom. That is mushroom. Tasty. That was really tasty. 850. <laughs> Ridiculous. Beautiful really remote. What can you do? What can you do? It's part of the experience, they say. Yeah. Is it tasty? There's only sugar on the other one. Yes. No, the Mexicans are better, I think. That is better than it. 500 euro. Uh, We're finally full. <laughs> not really, but I'm <laughs> ready to go home. <laughs> I would say that was the very first good first day uh, in Madrid. Good? I would say so too. It's quarter past nine. Quarter past nine. Perfect time to go home to sleep. Because <laughs> we're old people. Oh, yeah, we all are. That's all I have. Uh, good night. Today in Madrid, we're in this fancy park. It has a fountain there, it has trees there, even stairs. That's all the free requirements for a park to be fancy. Even a guy doing nature things with a motor ma machine, uh, that makes everything sound a lot. That sounds a lot, you know. Um, those are all the requirements for a fancy park. And a guy running, perfect. It's a lake! Crazy! Do you think there are fishes in the lake? Maybe I should have a dive and have a look. It's a fancy statue. There was something jumping in the water. Well, that was a fish. There are fish in this water. Looks dangerous to get li riding on the lion. Yeah, I wouldn't let my kid ride on the lion. I would. Yeah. Super cool. Coolest kid in the whole schoolyard. Okay. It's a big one. Welcome to my throne. Your throne? Yeah, what can I say? This park was really pretty and the monuments were really beautiful. Also, big and impressive, just like it should in the capital of a former empire. I don't want to uh, clean the window on that one. <laughs> no. Wildlife is abundant in this park. You can see fish, birds, and turtles. <gasps> you missed a fish. No, I see it, I see it, I see it. You can see it on the camera probably, but it's there. Oh, baby. Baby yeah. turtle. Going for a tunnel. What the fuck was that? It was huge and yeah. it jumped. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to be in that water. No? No, I think there are piranhas. Shit. That would make sense. Yeah. yeah. Let's enter. La Rosaleda. Mm. I guess so. That would make sense. It is pretty. Look at all these roses. Yeah, they're all in full bloom. That'll be crazy for you. It's not pretty. Mm. 
roses in all the colors. Yeah, it's really dark behind. Shortly after, it started raining, so we escaped into a small restaurant for some lunch. Better if I add a history. Yesterday we paid 10 euro only for the small portion of the Yeah, we paid 10 euro for two dishes and drinks. <laughs> Go here instead. Look. Look. She even gets fries. <gasps> that looks vegetarian. <laughs> well, you do need to meat, I guess. So. Count. <laughs> As vegetarian. And after a delicious two course 10 euro lunch, we headed to another park. In this direction. Probably behind these houses, I guess. Is this the Egyptian temple? I guess. It looks broken. Welcome to Egypt, everyone. <laughs> well, if you wanted to visit an Egyptian temple, I would go to Egypt. Many months later. You see, I did want to visit an Egyptian temple. Coming soon on this channel, so stay tuned. Oh, well, back to where we were. Egypt. 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 Look at this. <laughs> Fuck Egypt. You're looking at us. Oh yeah. Well, just a second here. I'm gonna show you. Cool view. That is indeed a cool view. I don't know. You're blocking the fucking palace. You should I get out of the view. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Bye. No. I'm just kidding. How uh, do we plan our day? Well, we planned it around going into the palace for free, for five. Yeah. What time is it now? I don't know, five. Yeah? Yeah. What happened? Oh, we were starting to set a line, and then they told us there's no free entrance today because they have an event. And well, we're yeah. still able to pay, but we have to get out by six. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Cool, cool. Well, it doesn't really matter. We didn't just dress to get here. No. I'm really relaxed because I just had a, an hour of playing around. So. Yeah. Oh well. Oh well. We tried. Huh? We, tried. we tried. Another time. Another time. How's it going? Good. I just don't want too much on it, you know? So I'm trying to be careful here. Do you also want? No, I'm good. Some nice Iberica ham. Well, that is not olive oil, I would say. No, it's tastier. Mm. Very nice, very nice. And so started our final day in Madrid. It was a hot day, so we decided to head to the massive Casa de Campo Park and just chill out. It is really hot to get from going to a big fucking park. The only reason we're going to Madrid. That's why I wanted to go there. <laughs> yeah, that was your, your argument to convince me. Yeah, she was not too convinced about going to Madrid. Now she loves it. Yeah, Mona, I said, it must have a really big park. <laughs> we found a park. We found a park. It was behind all the trees. It was behind all the trees. <laughs> We're almost in a jungle. <laughs> With a road. You can see it on the camera, can you? Oh, I'm pretty sure you can. Especially can you the, see the, the blue signs. They warn for crocodiles. That is not crocodiles. Man. Across this know? river, you have to walk on, the, on those thingies. Otherwise, the crocodile will eat you. The crocodile will eat you pretty soon, yeah? That is not supposed to mean. <laughs> We arrived at Wild Lake, filled with what seems to be some type of tool for a game or a ritual by the indigenous population. Probably the sacrifice things in there. I will sacrifice it in there. 
keeping it hostage. So. She stole my stick. <laughs> you were trying to feed me the stick. No. Yes. I was offering it like, you know, grass thingy in cowboy boots. So, no. Yeah, and then she stole my stick. <laughs> Dirty, I don't want to fight any too hard. Look, this one's perfect. I don't want to. <laughs> right here. I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> I got my stick back. Just stay back. How long have we been laying here for? Oh, I don't know. When did we arrive? I don't know. I really don't know. I have no idea. I really don't know. Let's see, when did I buy my shirt? At half past one. Mm -hmm. Then we have to walk here a little bit. Yep. Yeah. Not too long. It is five. It's five. Oh, not too bad then. No. Like three hours. Yeah. But we haven't do, been doing anything. No. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. It's really nice. I really gotta say, they've got great parks in Madrid to just chill out. But now it's time for us to move on, so we headed down into the massive Madrid metro. goes on forever. <laughs> we'll get there. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. How do we have those hallways that we walk through? I don't know, I thought it was a three kilometers. You could have called it the same station. No. Absolutely not the same station. The following Thursday. Yeah. Cool. We made it! And so we're finally on our way to the Madrid bus station. Yeah, we really suck at interrailing, but the train connections to Portugal were shit, and we figured that a night bus would save us one night of accommodation, so... This camera is breaking. <laughs> Let's see. Let's... Oh, I'm glad we have some time. Yeah, this bus station is horribly unclear. <laughs> it doesn't say where the platforms are. It gives you the platform, but not where the platform is. Very confusing. One to seven, or 49 to 59. Okay. Apparently we were, we were running around on this platform for 15 minutes already. We don't have time. What? Well, we kind of have time. Yeah. A little bit of time. Yeah, we have 15 minutes more to figure out where, where to go. Well, it's not only there, so it's not there. No. I want to see what people find out. Though. I don't know. But just in time, we somehow found our platform and got on the bus. I think that's a good spot to wrap it up for this time. Madrid was a surprise for both of us. We had expected a big city and that it would be impressive, but not really a place we would enjoy for more than a few days. But we were wrong. It sure had the hustle and bustle of a big city, but it was also so easy to escape into a cozy quiet neighborhood or a big beautiful park. Anyway, we were now on our way to Portugal, the last country we would visit on this journey, and we were excited. If you are as well, give this video a thumbs up, maybe hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you there. Next stop, Porto. Look at Johannes, he's balancing on that, huh? He's struggling.